All praises to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Chakwadash, the honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, Shalom, salutations to the hopeful elect that's fighting a good fight of faith and truth. In sincerity and wholeheartedly, Shalom to the Aqua, which is the women believers, Shalom to you. All praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. So, this is just a edification video about how Jesus have no effect and a little comic relief, you know. But look at this. You better dip that cookie again. The devil is still up in that cookie. Now, she got baptized, right? But look how she came out of the water. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. You better dip that cookie again. The devil is still up in that cookie. One more time. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. You better dip. Yeah, so just a little comic relief, but also I could use some edification. I can use some edification out of this. So, you know, this is why the Lord said this. <clears throat> For Hamashiach sent me not to baptize, but to preach the gospel, not with wisdom of words, lest the cross of Hamashiach should be made of none effect. Now, if you want to go dump somebody in some water, the scriptures is not against it. But the Lord said that the way that you're supposed to really be washed is by the washing of the word. OK, so dipping, being dipped in water. It don't do anything for you. Your filthiness is still there, you know. Matter of fact, since I said washing by the water of the word. Nope, I think it's twenty six. Yep, that he might sanctify and cleanse it with the washing of water by the word. All right. So this is how you get cleanse. See, the word, the script, Yahweh said, the words that I speak unto you, that is spirit and that is life. In John 6 and 63. Let's watch it again. <laughs> that cookie again. The devil is still up in that cookie. You better dip that cookie again. <laughs> but yeah, so when I seen that, I was just laughing because, like I said, so I got a, my family is full of Christians, Jesus, uh, fanatics. And for a person who used to be who the Lord, you know, had mercy upon and brought me out of that. I've been baptized before. Matter of fact, I think the same day that I um, was baptized, I think I sold some weed to somebody that same day. So yeah, it's like Jesus do not bring no fear to you, no discipline to you. You know, it's really just like a, like church is a form of entertainment. It's like something to do to make you feel like you holy. <clears throat> That's my personal experience. So, um, It says, sanctify them through your truth. Your word is truth. This is how you sanctify somebody. Sanctify means to be made holy. Okay. Set apart. So, yeah, baptism, it don't go far. Because the thing is, you're not even being baptized in the name of Yahweh Shai. You're being baptized in Jesus. So, you know, but let's go back to the first scripture. For now, this is what they call him, right? Christ. But for Hamashiach sent me not to baptize, but to preach the gospel. Okay. So this is how the word, this word cleanses you. And I think that's uh, first Peter's one thirty one or one twenty one, something like that. Nope, it's, it must be 321 or something. That was a good scripture too. So it said, The like figure whereunto even baptism do also now save us, not the putting away of the filth of the flesh, 
but answer of a good conscience towards the Most High by the resurrection of Yahweh Shah Mashiach. Let's see if I can find another version. Basic um, English Bible. In baptism, of which this is an image, now gives you salvation, not by washing clean the flesh, but by making you free from the sense of sin before the Most High through the coming again of Yahweh Shah Mashiach. So, it's not that baptism is wicked or anything like that, but it don't clean your flesh, all right? So you got people who think that, oh, I've been dumped in the water and now they're holy. It don't work that way. Even the Lord had to tell uh, Nicodemus this, is to jump straight to the point. He said, Yahweh shall answer, Verily, verily, I say unto you, except a man be born of the water and of the spirit, he cannot enter into the kingdom of the Most High. Now, what do the water represent? This word. We just read about it. Okay? So, that's how a man is cleansed. That's how a man change. Because the scriptures talks about how this word, oh, a matter of fact, he said, I therefore put you in remembrance. So, the ones who are meant to get this truth, they heard the word and then they believed it and then they kept it. So let's watch it again. <laughs> the devil is still up in that cookie. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. You better dip that cookie again. The devil is still up in that cookie. So to end it on there, this is a little comic relief. Also, I felt like I could get some edification out of it. But yeah, so Jesus have no effect. The hell? What happened? That is dude. That is the scripture. Maybe it's second Corinthians. Yep, my bad. <laughs> Therefore, if any man be Hamashiach, he is a new creature. The old things are passed away. She came out of the water sassy. <laughs> she came out of the water the way that she still was. I mean, because all we can all we can um, abstract from is the way that she came out the water. Like, slay it, girlfriend. That's probably how she always was, you know? So it said, behold, all things are become new. So she ain't come out of that water humble at all. She came out of that world. I mean, that water proud. All right. The Lord said he resisted the proud and give of grace unto the humble. So, yeah. So, like I said, it's a little quick edification. Thought it was funny, you know, because, you know, Jesus is still on the proud, still in souls, which, you know, that's the Lord's will. Because the um, this truth is not for everybody. The Lord said that the elect obtained and the rest were blinded. So, Shalom.